Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing well. Today's video, as you can tell from the title, is going to be my London haul because I spent too much money and I want to show you guys what I got. I got a lot of stuff at Primark, which was very exciting, and um, other places. So I'm going to show you guys what I got. Hopefully you like it. Most of the stuff I will either be taking pictures in on my Instagram or have already taken pictures in on my Instagram. So check out my Instagram. It's Miss Michaela G, just the same way it's spelled here. Also, of course, if you are new, don't forget to subscribe. I have a lot of fun summer videos coming up. But I wanted to get um, the travel stuff out of the way first and I do have travel excuse me I do have travel vlogs that are going up on my main channel here so the Brighton one was already posted and um, when the London and Paris vlogs go up I will link them down below as well if you want to go check out those if you're interested and let's go ahead and jump into the haul so I have a random assortment of a lot of clothing, shoes, accessories, and then random stuff. So I'm going to start with a random item, and this is a new planner I picked up from Kiki K. So I had no idea what new planner I wanted to get. I definitely did need a new one, and you guys know I love planners, but I was really like, I just did not know what to get. So I ended up getting this one, and it's one of those ones where you just like refill the pages kind of thing. So I just love this binder thing. It was so cute. It came with like all the notepads, some stickers, and then... Um, another like to-do list in the back here and then it had all the tabs and then some extra ones so it just seemed like a really good idea and I really liked it you can also get it monogrammed at uh, Kiki K so that is what I did I got MMG from Miss Michaela G not actually my initials but MSG is like not the best initials to have so that is why I didn't get that um but yeah I really like my new planner not sure how this is going to work with future plan with me's if I continue to do those but let me know if you guys would be interested in me showing you guys how I use this let me know not super sure but moving on I think one of the only things I purchased at Topshop were a new pair of jeans that I wore a ton on the trip I'm really glad I bought them I just picked up a new pair of Jamie jeans and these are the yeah Jamie jeans I don't really know they don't have any rips in them they're like a lighter wash so I thought they would be good for summer super flattering very comfy very snug can't say enough good things I really like them moving on to a store that's called Bershka I think that's how you pronounce it it is a sister store of Zara so it's like the I don't know like teen version of Zara which I found way more priced reasonably and I also just really thought this stuff was cute so I picked up quite a few things from there got a lot of t-shirts so this one just says something in French that I'm going to ill pronounce so I will not but it's really cute and I like the rainbows on it I was gonna wear it in France and take a picture but I forgot to do that so I'm gonna wear it here the next shirt I got is this white blouse it has like a little button down little tie little um like cap sleeves thought it was really nice and basic so I picked that up as you guys can see noodle has joined us as I was saying I got these shorts also from Bershka they have like a frayed paper bag top super cute very very comfortable so I was really excited about that has a nice tie and I just jean shorts are a must for summer so I got these ones um also from Bershka I got the top I'm wearing which is just a black tie top and then I got it in this uh white and blue stripe as well it was calling me I love shirts like this for the summer they go with jean shorts they go with jeans they go with literally everything and they're comfortable the next thing I have to share with you guys is from Jo Malone London and it came in this most beautiful box and this is kind of like my expensive souvenir of the trip I wanted to get something that was a little bit like nicer and so I went with this um, also the experience in the store was just like so unbelievable they like wrapped the gifts so nicely and like sprayed it with perfume and stuff and I just felt bougie so it was really really nice um, but the first thing I got was actually a smaller size they do make a bigger one of these but I had my eye on this scent for a really really long time and this is the Earl Grey and cucumber cologne I love this scent it's so unique and I just I'm really into scents right now but yeah I thought I would get the smaller size because it'll last me a long time anyway it does have a spray it's not uh, roll over all which is nice and I just really like it and then uh, while I was in there I was like I might as well just get a candle too so I got this one this is the peony and blush suede candle so beautiful smells amazing haven't even like unpackaged it yet because I really like the bow on it but yeah this was just a nice purchase for me and the fact that I got it in London was kind of special obviously they do have it like in the States and Canada but I just wanted to get it while I was there and they also threw in some like matches which was super cute so yeah that was my like expensive gift of the of the trip but I'm really really happy with it this is definitely all in no particular order but the next thing I got was a pair of shoes from New Look I had been looking for white pointed heels for a very long time and I finally found them they were on sale 
I'm pretty happy about them. They're definitely like a staple summer shoe for me because they literally go with everything. Moving on to some more accessories. I got three pairs of sunglasses while I was away. These first ones are key. I got them from Topshop and they are massive, but I absolutely love them. I don't have any sunglasses that are this big, which is kind of surprising considering how much I love sunglasses. And then I actually also found the Desi Perkins key sunglasses. The, this is her most recent collection. Um, these ones are called Don't At Me and I have been searching for these. They had the white ones as well, but I decided to go with the black. They're quite fancy, so I got both of those from Topshop. And I guess this is a good time to go into the stuff I got at Primark. If you guys don't know, Primark is like the big store there. It's really inexpensive. There's a lot of different sections. I was amazed. We spent so many hours in there, and I hit up every section as best as I could while we were there. Um, but the sunglasses were actually the last thing I picked up, and these were like three pounds, and these are kind of like those um, Ray-Ban style, which I didn't know if they would look good on me, so I'm really glad I only spent three pounds to see but I really like them so far um so yeah they're super delicate obviously because they're not that expensive but yeah I really like those I also hit up the earring section which you guys know I love my tassels these are from Primark and then I also got I'm gonna show these like pretty fast but I got these little like set of hoops I got this black hoop pair with like kind of like a pom-pom design on it um, I got these pink ones which I thought were really really pretty pink and gold little like dangly ones these ones were so, so fun. I could not leave without them. I thought they would be perfect for summer. They're very bright, very bold. So with a basic outfit, I think those will look really good. And then the last crazy pair, these look like so fun. Um, they kind of look like this. And then they have like tassels, which some of them are still in their little plastic thing, but they're just, they're so extra, but I love them because they're all very inexpensive. All of these were like three pounds each. I did also pick up a belt while I was there, although I should have definitely gotten a smaller size. This is really similar to the one I have from Princess Polly with like the little double um, circle thing. So yeah, that was, I think, three pounds as well, which was really great. Love me some belts. And then moving on to the clothing, I got this t-shirt that is bright yellow and says, oh baby, really basic. And then I got a couple tie tops. So this one is just striped with a tie in the front, super cute. I actually saw someone um, at a restaurant wearing this and I was like, oh, that's really cute. And then found it in Primark the next day. I'm like, I'm buying it. And then this top, which is gonna be a little bit harder to show. Um, this is like a black tie top with like really flowy sleeves. I really like the pattern on this one. Um, just like super tropical and fun and like really, yeah, wide sleeves and ties. And then this one is another basic tie top. So these will be good with like jean shorts and stuff in the summer as well. Just super cute. Um, I got a bathing suit. This one is striped with cactuses on it. It's very comfortable and fits really well. So that is good for a basic swimsuit. I think that was like three pounds. I got a couple body suits. This one is like fire orange and I thought it would look really good in the summertime. So that is it. It's off the shoulder and it has a little like um, V dip here. So it's really, really flattering. Um, they're very, very comfy. So I actually also got it in striped um, these are black stripes yeah so just off the shoulder it does have like a little bit of a grip lining too which is nice but yeah they are very comfortable and then the last t-shirt I got from Primark is this one and it says just peachy and it's gray super basic and then I picked up three pairs of shoes because their shoe section was really really good and actually I was wearing a pair of heels that day that my feet were hurting so I actually grabbed these to put on right away so these are just some slip-ons with um, pink bows. Really cute, really good basic shoe. I picked up these gingham printed sandal slip-on slides kind of thing. These would look really cute with these earrings. Um, yeah, so these were what, three pounds, six pounds, six pounds. And then these shoes I've been wearing a ton since I got them. I have been looking for a black pair of just like slip-on shoes. And I'm really glad I waited and got them at Primark because they were so inexpensive and they are so comfy. So they just look like that. I can pass on the studs on the back, but it doesn't really bother me. So yeah, those are them. And I've been wearing these non-stop. And before I show you the last little bit of clothing, I wanted to mention this because it's something random that I picked up but I wanted to share. I got tonic water because I like gin and tonics and one of the flavors that they have a lot there is elderflower, which I found amazing and delicious. So I picked up some tonic water and I brought this whole thing back. There's what, like eight cans in here? I did it and I'm very excited to drink these. <laughs> the next two pieces are from Forever 21, which I actually really did not want to go in there because obviously we have Forever 21 here. I really wanted to shop at stores we didn't have, which 
I tried to do as best as I could, but I'm really glad I did because I found some really cute things in Forever 21. Only two, but I love them. The first one is this uh, polka dotted top. It's kind of like bustier almost because it has like the boob holes. Is that correct? Or probably not. Um, but it has like these little like frilly sleeves and then it does have a really long tie so you can tie it in the back or the front. So cute. I tried this on with shorts and I love it. And then this dress I absolutely love as well. It is again polka dotted, which is kind of funny. Same kind of sleeves on this one, but it is just your basic summer dress. So it's um, kind of tighter in the top and then flows down. It's very flattering and very, very cute. I love the fabric. It feels really good quality and I'm really happy I got that. And then moving on, I think the last place is Zara. So I just picked up a pair of white shorts. Um, had summer in mind obviously so these are just like really nice casual white shorts hopefully i don't get them dirty probably will and then if you guys saw my picture on instagram i will insert it right here wearing a pink suit i wore this when i went up the eiffel tower it was a very warm day that was not the best choice but i love this and i've been wanting a pink pantsuit for a very long time so i got this one at uh, zara and i love it because it's like the shade of pink i really wanted and so this is the jacket it is definitely wrinkly so i apologize for that but it is um um, a little bit longer. It's like an oversized one. I got the top. I believe this is a medium a US medium Yeah, so this fits really nicely in the arms It's quite long, but I really like it and I think it'll go well Even if I wanted to wear like jeans and those white heels I think that'll look really good, but I absolutely love the pants as well They are one of the most comfortable pairs of pants I've ever worn and this is what they look like again super wrinkly So I apologize, um, but yeah, they're super super cute They're high-waisted and then they are a little bit cropped and then um, Folded at the bottom and it's sewn that way so yeah, I love this outfit. It was so comfortable and I am really happy I bought it. And the last thing I picked up while I was away was this skirt from Zara. This was found in their bathing suit section. So this is actually meant to be like a bathing suit cover up wrap type thing, but it is so cute. I love the vibrant color. It's so perfect for summer. I love the like basic style wrap skirts too. I really like the way they fit and they look. Um, it is kind of like a towel material, so it definitely is meant for the beach, but uh, I might wear it not at the beach because it's that cute but yeah that is the last thing i got give this video a thumbs up if you want to see more hauls from me in the future or if you just like haul videos in general and let me know in the comment down below which item i picked up you like the most because i'm always curious about that and if you want to see what i wore on my trip check out the vlogs or my instagram because i did a lot of fashion posts so if you want to see the stuff because i didn't really haul that stuff that i wore on my trip mostly before i went so if you want to see those items definitely check out my instagram and i will see you guys in my next video have a great day